It's a new season and a brand new night for Lafayette College field hockey as the Leopards rolled with a 3-0 win over Hofstra here on opening night. Matt Nelson here with you in the Lafayette Sports Network. The head coach Jen Stone here and Rosie Shanks, the player of the game, to my left. And coach, we'll start with you. Certainly a, a big time victory for this program here on opening night. When did you realize that the momentum was shifting in your team's favor? I don't think there was a specific moment when it felt as though momentum shift. I thought in general, though, that the team did a very good job of holding possession um, and being pretty strong in their decision making to, to retain possession of the ball. Obviously, in any sport, usually, usually the longer you have the ball, the more opportunity that you have. Um, and I thought for the most part, we, ha uh, we had the better of, of the side in that in that percentage. Um, we had a little bit of a dip in the first half um, and Hofstra created some potential really dangerous threats uh, but I thought the group was pretty resilient in that regard and um, sort of found their bearings again and we were able to take control of possession um, and with that came attacking opportunities. Coach congratulations on the win as we turn our attention now to the player of the game Rosie Shanks two goals one in each frame and Rosie the first goal was from a long pass from one of your teammates you're wide open it was you versus is the goalie what were you looking for when you took that shot uh, honestly I was just looking for a touch on the ball it was one of those loose ones and it was a 50 50 and I was just determined to get there before the keeper so it was good to get it in and then the second goal to put it away with under three to play in the second the exclamation point basically how confident did you feel after scoring that goal knowing that this team had secured the first win of the season uh, I think it's fantastic to have a win especially on our home field uh, in our first game as well and I think it was a great team effort and we can only go up from there now you got a three-game road trip coming up, again, including two games at GMU, including one against Appalachian State. How much confidence does a win like this give for you and your team going forward? A lot of confidence, but I think it's important that we look at the areas of weakness that were in the game, and we improve from there and take it into the weekend. Rosie, congratulations on the win. Thank you. And with that... The next stop for Lafayette College, as I mentioned, will be at JMU next weekend. They'll take on Appalachian State next Saturday, followed by JMU next Sunday before they head to Fairfield. And then they'll be right back here at Rappold Field on September the 10th. They'll take on the Drexel Dragons at 12.05 p.m. Eastern. You can catch the game on the Patriot League Network if you're unable to make it out here to Rappold Field. For the Lafayette Sports Network, I'm Matt Nelson.